Now, as we all know, President Trump is promising to cut regulations, get rid of that red tape. Come on in, Maureen Allhausen, who is the acting chair of the Federal Trade Commission. I asked you earlier, I wanted to get ready for this, what regulations can be cut very quickly that would have a positive effect on everyday life? And I know your response, it is to get rid of some of these crazy licensing ideas, right? Spell it out, please, Maureen. Uh, absolutely, Stuart. One of the issues that we've seen is the incredible growth in occupational licensing. Right now, consumer uh, workers today, about 30% of workers, need a permission slip from the government to engage in their occupation. And back in the 1950s, it was a mere 5%. And studies show that this is costing close to 3 million jobs in the economy and billions of dollars in consumer costs. It particularly hits people at the bottom end of the economic ladder yeah. and small business and, believe it or not, military spouses. Well, we, we've heard horror stories about it. You need a license from the government if you want to braid someone's hair. You need a license from the government if you want to open a nail salon. I think you need about 12 permits for a nail salon. And the list is endless. But the question is, can you, at the federal level, with a sweep of the pen, get rid of at least some of these licensing uh, requirements? Well, unfortunately, it's not as easy as getting rid of it with the sweep of the pen at the federal level because these are state, uh, state regulations. What I've done, though, is convene an economic liberty task force at the Federal Trade Commission to work with interested parties in the states, governors, state legislators, attorneys general, who are interested in making improvements here. Yeah. And we're going to be a convener, and we're going to shine a light on this issue. And where we can bring enforcement action in the antitrust <clears throat> arena, we will. You know, Maureen, I, I really want to thank you very much, because so often we talk about getting rid of red tape, cutting regulations, and you come up with some woolly scheme that we don't really understand. Nobody gets the point. But you've hit right at it. Get rid of these occupational licensing requirements. I find that really, really refreshing. Now I have to ask you, are you the acting tr uh, Federal Trade Commissioner? Uh, I'm the acting chairman okay, of acting the Federal chair. Trade Commission. Forgi I've been a commissioner for about five years. Uh, again, forgive me, are you a holdover from the Obama administration? And if so, what on earth are you doing getting rid of licensing requirements? <laughs> Well, Stuart, I'm a Republican. I was appointed Clearly. to take the Republican <laughs> seat. And so I've been designating the, the acting chair. But this is an issue. Economic liberty is an issue that has driven much of my career. I've been working on yeah. it for decades uh, through advocacy, through enforcement, and through just drawing attention to the problems that it's creating for everyday yes. Americans. And let the market take care of it. If you go to a barber and you get a lousy haircut, you don't go back. It doesn't need a licensing from the government to tell me that it was a lousy haircut. Maria, you were absolutely right. Go forward. Press on, please. We're all in your corner. Marina Allhausen, thanks very much for joining us with an excellent idea. We approve of that. Thank you, ma'am. Great. Thank you, Stuart. Okay.